all right guys we're back and we are going to do our first bash of the 2023 we've got so much snow here in utah that it was impossible to do anything but uh, get your vehicles all rusty i ran the crate in a couple times but just nothing fun everything got salty and rusty i hate that but i did run them and uh got some vehicles here we got the skeeter the Creighton 4s we got the 6s coronos we got the rival mt and we got the ramp and we're gonna do a little bit of running i'm gonna brought out all four vehicles because i figured i needed to get in some time I haven't shot any videos in a while all winter because of the snow it's been like in a cocoon finally actually got my real cars unburied today my jeep and etc so yeah, we're going to give these a run. We're going to start with the 4S trucks here first. I may put all these trucks in one video. We may do separate videos. So let me get the ramp out. All right, we're going to run the Skeeter first. Like I said, we haven't been out all winter. We've been cooped up for four months since we've really ran anything. So Skeeter's up first. Skeeter's running stock electronics. But it has been widened and is running Pro-Line tires, trenchers. See if I can even remember how to how to film. It's been so long. We'll practice jump in. Can't wait till all this mud goes away. Couldn't get this thing to flip at all with the original tires. That's why I changed it. Oh. The ramp that I have is the one that T-Bone and Racing used to make. Pretty sad that they're not in business anymore because um, I was hoping to pick up a couple of these. Only got the one. It's the big one. It was well worth the $300 I spent on it. It should have been a flip, but I wasn't quite prepared. a quick view of what's inside this thing so we have the team Corelli 6500 HV lipo high voltage lipo this ESC will handle it it's a max 10 the motor does get hot so you have to run a fan which that seems to be working pretty well just a single fan the factory fan that came on the ESC didn't work very well so it did power hobby 
high speed fan on there. We did the, the wider knuckles and axles to get a little wider stamps. We're running the Proline Trencher Low LPs. That's a low profile. Absolutely perfect for this truck. Thing that rips, does really well. Okay, that's it for a great day of bashing. We finally got the cars out. I mentioned multiple times about the snow. I think I might do the break this up in multiple videos. Maybe even do a one day compilation video. But we uh, ran a Team Crowley Skeeter, Team Crowley Kronos, uh, Arma Creighton 4S, and the Team Associated Rival MT-10. Everything was awesome. The Kronos broke kind of early. It was on a stupid tumble. Easy, easy fix. Just a shock rod end. Nothing, no major damage. The Creighton probably got the worst of it. Broken wing, cracked chassis. But it's still drivable, still usable. I mean, and also pretty easy fix. I don't think the chassis is going to be too big a deal for a little while. But yeah, great day of bashing. So glad to finally get out of this snow. We've had so much snow here in Utah that it's crazy. And this was a lot of fun. Please like, subscribe, and share. Thanks for watching.